So you will use our new Snapshot app to enter snapshot data the same way that you have on your paper water quality sheets in the past. Now, the site number as well as the date and the time will be automatically generated for you. From here, you can enter which group you're part of, and then you can make your observations right in the app. Using a series of checkboxes, you can also type in your values, and there are easy drop-down options for your chemical parameters. There are three sections. One is to monitor weather. The other is for visual observations for the water that you're analyzing. What does your water look like? What does it smell like? And are animals present nearby? Finally, you can use your snapshot kit materials to perform your chemical tests and enter the values in the corresponding fields. For transparency, you want to enter a centimeter value to the nearest whole number. Water temperature will be in degrees Fahrenheit. A pH value will be entered between 4 and 9. And then you will use the drop-down menu for the additional parameters. It's important not to click the checkbox above your keyboard until you are finished entering all of your data. Clicking that checkbox will submit your data to the app. However, if you need to go back and make some edits, you can go back to the main menu and re-enter the data. When entering your chloride data, be sure to convert your value to milligrams per liter by referring to the conversion table on the bottle of test strips. From here, you can add any additional comments and click that checkbox to complete the survey for that particular snapshot site.